Hey, what up everybody? Major G, and it is time for another episode of... Oh, whoops. I'll be right back. All right, time for another episode of The Flash. Whatever she said, then I'm that. If this here rocks to y'all, then we laugh. Whatever she said, then I'm that. If this here rocks to y'all, then we laugh. Hey, what up, guys? It's uh, Major G, and. <laughs> Sorry, I'm still a little sick. I'm gonna try and get this uh, flash out the way because I'm pro because I'm gonna be out of commission for a few days. I'm about to go back east, so hopefully I'll have this up by on uh, sometime on Wednesday. Um, but uh, anyway, I'm gonna be watching the Flash today. Um, just it came out a few hours ago. And I just had the opportunity to, to watch it. Um, I'm not wearing my flash shirt right now. I'm in the middle of doing laundry. So, uh, yeah, that's that's up. With, that's what's up with that. Um. So uh, last episode, everybody found out that Caitlin was Killer Frost, or she was becoming Killer Frost, and. Uh, um. Where else? Oh yeah. Uh, we met um, Savitar. Either I, I don't remember what the guy's name. Uh, well, I know what the guy's name is. I just I'm I'm not familiar with his character too much. Whether it's Godspeed or Savitar, I'm not very familiar with that particular character. Uh, I must admit. Um, what else? Uh, and Wally is now Kid Flash. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty freaking awesome. I'm glad about that, to be honest. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get on with this. Handy dandy remote. All right, let's get on with this. It's time for The Flash. The Flash reaction starts now. Am I her? Yeah, I saw the both of us like full on vibe versus killer frost. You know what? Here's a here's an interesting thought. What if it was Cisco that becomes evil? Because we know that in uh, the comics, Vibe does become evil, um, just like he does, just like Reverb did in Earth Two. Oh shoot! Oh my God! What is this? What? What? What the heck? No! What's happening? Holy crap, dude! Dang! Yo! Hey, Greggy, Greg, Gruddy Grumberg. Nice. Hey, Kevin Smith directed. This is not your fault. Yeah, it is. Yes and no. Oh, this can't be good. Where is 
Yep, definitely not good. Yep, definitely not good. This is not what good. What is going on? And Fairmont, all the way down to Gleason. Move. Move. Hey, Grunny. Patterson. Proper notion. Oh, great. More suggestions from the genius over here. You don't call the genius. The genius calls you. Question. Oh my God. How did you catch your Captain Cold? But his M.O. strikingly similar to our dear Caitlin's. What? No, we we tracked him using the satellite to scan for ultraviolet cold signatures. Uh, got it. <laughs> <laughs> No, nothing near this. You don't want to hurt anybody. She's willing to hurt someone. Knock her out. <laughs> Caitlin, let me help you. Like you helped her mother. Oh, oh boy. I can fix this. Oh, like you fixed Cisco's family? <sighs> you didn't tell Cisco that you screwed him worst of all, did you? You hear that, Cisco? Dante was alive. Healthy and happy until Barry created Flashpoint. When he reset things, that's what killed him. Barry is the reason your brother is dead. Wow. That is cool. Cisco. Hey, man. Um, oh, boy. Can we do that? Yeah. One step at a time, bro. Cisco, if you find her, I won't call you. You've done enough. <sighs> wow! Salt! Unfortunately, my DNA is what it used to be. So believe me when I say, answer every one of my questions or I will harm you. Yo, that is a Terminator reference if I ever saw one. My lord has special plans for you. Okay, let's know. Or should I say, Killer Frost? Killer Frost. Oh! Caitlin! Oh my God! Uh. Caitlin, oh, I think this is the future he saw. What? I make you promise, Ronnie. You know, for a hero, Flash, you sure let a lot of people around you die. Oh. Uh, How do you know that Caitlin wasn't already affected by the accelerator explosion, or that Dante wouldn't have died in a car accident anyway? You are not God, Barry. She's got a valid point. Also, it's when he's hurting the most that he makes the, the bad decisions. Wally. Oh, shoot! Off, I don't move. Like I said, you're free to go. What's the catch? You have to kill me. What is he doing? No, no, no. What? It's gonna be kill their friends because nothing matters to them anymore, right? Right? Come on. Oh, I see what he's doing. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there you are, Caitlin. I don't look so worried. I'm fine. I, I feel fine. In fact, I feel kind of awesome. Like everything is buzzing, electric. Like I can do anything. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Here it comes. I want to be honest with you. Ooh. Uh, brace yourself. I don't know. You got hit pretty hard. I don't have the foggiest who even kidnapped me at all. Really? There is one thing you can do for me, mate. Anything. Quit. What? Tender your resignation from the Central City Police Department effective immediately. Constant disregard for the rules and regulations, but your moral compass is broken, my friend. Oh, wow. I point blank. Do we have an agreement? Wow. 
That's a hefty price. What do you mean you didn't have a choice? Julian, you quit. He kept his mouth shut about Caitlin. Yep. That son of a bitch. Yep. <laughs> Old Skylight. We bring about my return. He is alchemy. He is alchemy. He is alchemy. Become my servant once more. Oh my god, we do it. He's alchemy. So, that was our episode of the Flash uh for this evening. Uh so it wasn't a really big episode, but a lot of cool things did happen. Uh for example, holy crap, Savitar is freaking broken. Um like this is a dude that would definitely beat instantaneous teleportation. Uh, <laughs> like, he was appearing and disappearing in different places, like, so so fast that it looked like he was in multiple places at the same time. Um, yeah, freaking broken. I need to find out who this guy is. Um, found out Julian is, in fact, alchemy. We did suspect that a lot of uh, reactors have been uh, speculating that for some time, including uh, myself. I think I speculated that uh, briefly, um, either an episode or two episodes ago. Um, what else? Uh, alchemy. Alchemy was... Yeah, we, we knew Alchemy. Yes, and uh, Caitlin. Uh, Savitar says that our Savitar's followers knew exactly who Caitlyn Snow was. Apparently, he's shown them the future. Um, and we he's seen that Caitlyn Snow is somebody that ends up becoming evil. Not a definite, but a possibility. Um, Barry was able to talk her down, which is good. Um, so there's a possibility she may end up becoming the good version of Killer Frost. Um, which I do believe she does become good, uh, 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 a hero, uh, at, after some point in the comics. Um, so that is entirely possible that she could stay a hero. Um, or a hero support. Uh, Wally is Kid Flash. Um, now, one of the, one of the things that, one of the benefits of him not completing his his cocoon time maybe that or one maybe that he wasn't programmed to he completely hear alchemy and savitar like um the others were um may may maybe maybe not we're not sure um but wally is uh wally is in fact kid flash uh, but he, it seems like he's going to be extra, extra, um, impulsive. So there's a possibility they may, and because remember in Flashpoint, Wally hated the name Kid Flash. Um, he seemed to like it in this, uh, in this, in, in this universe, but there's a possibility they may just give him the name Impulse. Um, that's purely me speculating, but there's a possibility he may end up becoming Impulse. Um, which is actually Bart Allen in the comics, um, and also was seen in Smallville. Uh, <sighs> anything else? I can't really think of anything off the top of my head. Um, Julian Alchemy. Uh, we're gonna have to see. Oh yes, we're gonna have to. Uh, Cisco found out that his Dante stays alive in the uh, original timeline. So, uh, remember during the episode I mentioned, hey, what if it's not Caitlyn who becomes evil? It's actually Cisco. So uh, there's a possibility that might happen, uh, is, what it, is what it might look like. Um, because that does happen in the comics. Vibe does end up becoming evil, much like Reverb did in the show. Um, and there, so there is a possibility that Caitlyn could become the hero who is fighting against Vibe, the villain. Uh, so that's entirely possible. 
and he could have completely misread that situation and just assumed that he was the hero. Um, anything else? Anything else that I can think of? Barry's no longer with the CCPD, which is fine in terms of the show because they he he wasn't really doing much there anyway. So it kind of makes sense that Julian would make him or he, he would end up having to leave his job in some way or fashion or form or something like that. Um, it just makes sense. Now, as for what he's going to do, we'll have to see how that works out. Um uh, and all that. Um, yeah, so that might be pretty much it in terms of uh, the, 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 the series, where the series is going. Um, yeah, so how do you guys feel about it? Um, oh, yeah, one more thing. <gasps> we do know there's a very good possibility that they're going to go the direction of the comics and make Wally faster than Barry. Um, so if you guys don't know, there have been like four flashes. Um, Barry, not counting, sorry, in terms of the modern age, uh, not counting Jay Garrick, there have been four flashes, five including Jay. Uh, Jay Garrick, Barry Allen, Wally West. Um, no, four, sorry, there have been four. Um, Jay Garrick, Barry Allen, Wally West, and Bart Allen. Um, those have been the four flashes. Um, out of them, Barry has the deepest connection with the Speed Force. However, Wally is easily the fastest out of all the flashes. Uh, so, there's a good, very good possibility that Wally may become faster than Barry. Um, and that is indicated by... Remember, they had the little throwaway line when he was doing the speed test. Uh, hey, how fast is he going? Oh, he's going faster than Barry when he first started. So, and and Barry only got faster when he started. Wally could very much do the same thing. Even though he's going faster than Barry was, he could very much become do that same kind of speed arc and just end up becoming faster than Barry ever was. Because, I mean, and once again, our Wally in this universe, the CW universe, is obsessed with speed. So he very they that might have been just kind of like a setup to get his character make his character the fastest out of all the flashes. So he may be the one who actually does the whole Savitar thing, like actually like gives Savitar a run for his money. Um because if I remember correctly. You know, there was a comic where the Flash does, in fact, beat instantaneous travel. Uh, sorry, instantaneous teleportation uh, across the universe. And that was Wally West. Wally West was the Flash who did that. Uh, Wally West was also the Flash who saved a half a million people from a nuclear bomb by carrying them out two, uh, one and two at a time. Uh, uh, now, uh, to like a spot like 20 miles away. Now, um, keep this in mind. He, this is not like as the bomb was counting down. The bomb had exploded, and Wally was carrying them one and two at a time uh, to, to a spot like 20 miles away. Okay? Half a million people. One and two at a time as a bomb is exploding. That's insane. That is absolutely insane. And that was Wally. Wally West was the one who did that. So, um, yeah, all the, pretty much all the broken crap that The Flash does, it's 95% of the time it's Wally West who does that. Um, so just keep that in mind. Uh, and that is, and it, and it looks like they might be setting up for something like that. So that would be off, that would be incredibly interesting. Um, all right, so, but let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Uh, everybody have a happy Thanksgiving, and until next time, I will see you guys later.
Oh! That's right! The Kinshaw Cyborg Superman! Holy crap! 